Hi guys, welcome to Storytime with Mrs. Pape. <laughs> Today I'm going to read you a story called Mother Goose. Oops, I mean Mother Bruce. Here we go, Mother Bruce. Bruce was a bear who lived all by himself. He was a grump. He did not like rain. He did not like sunny days. He did not like cute little animals. Bruce only liked one thing, eggs. He collected them from all over the forest. Good morning, Mrs. Sparrow. But Bruce didn't eat eggs raw like the other bears. He cooked them into fancy recipes that he found on the internet. One day, Bruce came across a recipe for hard-boiled goose eggs drizzled with honey salmon sauce. So he went out to get all the ingredients. First, he caught a few salmon. And then he collected honey from a local beehive. He liked to support local business, you see. Last, he went to Mrs. Goose's nest to pay her a visit. Are these eggs free-range organic? At home, Bruce prepared the eggs for hard boiling. But the fire in his stove fizzled, so he went out to get more wood. When Bruce came back, he was met with an unwelcome surprise. <gasps> Bruce became the victim of mistaken identity. Oh no. Bruce wanted hard boiled eggs, not goslings. He supposed he could settle for buttered goslings on toast, but for some reason he lost his appetite. Oh no. Bruce scooped up the little geese and stomped back to their nest. I will have to ask Mrs. Goose about her return policy, only to find Mrs. Goose had flown south early. Bruce left the goslings there anyway, and he went back home. Can I come in? Sure, come on in. Mama, mama, but he was followed. Bruce was very stern and said things like, go away. And I am not your mother. <laughs> and also, I liked you better when you were eggs. Bruce could not take it any longer. He became extra grumpy with them. Those are the little goslings. It didn't work. Goslings always follow their mother even if she is a he and he is a bear. Mama? Mama? Oh no, look. Look how mad he is. <laughs> Can you do a mad face? <laughs> Bruce was stuck with them. He tried to make the best of it. It was hard work. Yes, look, he's trying to cook for him. Blah. Ew! Yuck! Nap time's going well. Annoying baby geese. As seasons passed, Bruce watched the pesky goslings grow older. Stubborn teenage geese. Boring adult geese. And then one fall afternoon, he saw other goose families flying south. Finally, He'd be rid of those geese and he could take a long winter's nap. That sounds fun, a nap. Bruce explained migration, but they didn't listen. Bruce needed the geese to leave, so he got creative. Oh no, he's gonna sl slingshot them. Nothing worked. The geese would not leave Bruce. No. <sighs> Can you do this, Jane? <sighs> so Bruce decided to pack some bags and take his geese into town. Oh. 
<laughs> they boarded the bus <laughs> and migrated to and Miami. James Tom. <laughs> now every winter, Bruce and his bees head south together. They <laughs> they lays about at the beach in a tacky shirts, sipping ice cold lemonade while Bruce dreams of new recipes. Recipes that don't hatch. <laughs> uh oh. Mama? Uh -oh. What's that little animal? A turtle. A turtle. The end. I hope you liked my story.